today we're doing an experiment. Josh, before you start it, tell us a little bit about, you know, what it is we're doing and what your theory is, what you predict, that kind of thing. Okay. So, what, well, what this experiment is about is I wanted to, I wanted to see how fire would act if it was started in something and if it would burn down or burn out first. Mm. If it would burn up or down. Okay. If it burned out. All right. So, and what I mean by burn out is burn to the out of the outer part of the cardboard. Okay. Not like fizzle out. Okay. So, what we're doing today is we're going to drop a match in there. I don't know if you can see in there or mm -hmm, not. Mm -hmm. Let me get a good view. Okay, so we're going to drop a match in there. Okay. I stuffed some plastic in there. So then we're going to light a match. I I'm sorry. We're going to drop the match in there, and then we're hoping that it will catch the plastic on fire. Okay. And then what I think is it will burn out, and then I burn out to the outer part of the cardboard and then I think that it will burn down and burn up at the same time. Sounds good. So let's see what happens. Okay. Um. You have to stick it in there pretty quick because of the wind or get on the other side and that way you'll block okay. the wind. There you go. That's all right. Throw it in there. That'll be fuel. Okay. Well, do you want to light the match? You'll probably light it. No, you now. go ahead. You're doing fine. Okay. Don't worry about it. Every little boy needs practice striking matches. Part of Boyhood 101. I'm sorry. That's all right. More fuel. I don't know if these will light or not. They're light, they're light. Okay. I'll Do it a little percent. faster. Hmm. More fuel, more fuel. Pick one with the big white tip. Okay, so with one that with has lots like of phosphorus. Oh no! Oops. So here, that's this looks like a good one. Oh yeah. What do you think? Tip of that one broke off. No, yeah. Dad, the tip of it That's broke okay. off. That's okay. It'll still light. Okay. It's just a little harder. Hold it up. There you go. Okay. You may have gotten your match lighting skills from me. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and take the match, and you do what needs to be done. Well, watch your finger. I hope that I'm going to let go of it now. You know what might be missing is air. You might need a, to have a hole in the sides so the air can get in. In? You know? Here, I'll try again, and this time I'll try and actually stuff it down there. But if no air's getting in, you know what? It might not have enough oxygen. But try it out and see what okay. happens. My dad, I might do a match later. Here, watch me.
might be wet or something. All right, let's let it get caught. Okay, now grab it from this, there you go. That's it, that way you don't get burned. Now drop her in there. It's catching. See, no oxygen. Yep. So, what we've learned is that even though you have lots of good fuel in there, you've got plastic, cardboard, even red and white phosphorus, and nice wooden matches, what's missing? Air. Not just air, but specifically? Oxygen. Correct. So, let's say this experiment is to be continued. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll be back.